Yeah, exactly. All right, well, let's see. So both of them get out their projectiles early, as they should. It's kind of interesting because Freaky kind of wants to stop the and He wants to have, like, like you see him up till there at the ledge because he knows, like, I want that anti-air. I don't want Peach to be going for floats all the time. Absolutely. I feel like it's really hard to always set up anti-air sometimes this week. Like, yeah. you might want to just go for raw back air, a couple with punishes. But for him, it's the cover each time that Peach might be landing. Yeah. That's what he might be looking for. It's like, okay, if, if I can't get the anti-airs, I want to make sure I have Peach's landings covered for not last. It's always making sure, like, when I land, to be careful about Snake's commitment here. And and let's, for the viewers as well, let's not make sure we forget where that C4 is. And just as I say, he blows it up, using it to command the middle of the stage. You know, a common place for uh, uh, Snake's to use C4 is either recovering if someone's pressuring them below. They can drop it onto the player themselves. <gasps> Untackable! Yeah. That Nikita just taking souls. And again, you see Snake plant the C4 as well, blocking off the left side of the stage. It's it's interesting to see C4 because it's got like more than one use. You know, you can stick it onto the opponent. Ryan, you can be reverse yeah. it when you go for the high recovery. The thing about C4 too that's always scary is you always live in fear of it because if your opponent blows it up, and even if they miss you, you're like, oh, I was that close to it. Yeah. Like you have that fear factor. Not only that, a lot of snakes like to blow up their C4 if they no longer need it in that specific spot. I exactly. So you know, like like just when you think you're in the clear, I mean, the entire match, it, like. Uh, not last is going to need to keep a hard focused mind on mm -hmm. how long those grenades have been out, how long that C4 has been out, where it is, and you know his recovering habits, you know, and especially his out of shield habits as well. Yeah, down from the platform there, be reverse grenade, making sure he comes back anti air. He's got the platform wow. to protect him from the down air, so it's pretty good for him to just go ahead and stick that out. And now uh, at that point, like. He had nothing to really to fear. He had he had a grenade in play, so in case not last wanted to go around in front of him, he had a grenade. Oh. He had the up, so he had the platform of safety in this and oh, another up. It's over. It's uh. oh. No, you're good. You're good. You're good. You can. I was gonna say you can. <laughs> you can blow yourself up at that percent, and you'll be fine. <laughs> I think it's the greatest thing when like links do that as well. Oh yeah. Just the kamikaze. All right, let's see what he reads. Good wait by not last. I think it's too little, too late, but I appreciate no panic options. Yeah. In this scenario. And even then for Key, he kind of did have a dash back only because he wanted the down smash. Yeah. If not, Laos was going to do a roll get up. But forward tilt, both hits connecting, not dead. Here's the Nikita man, sends the missile launch out. <laughs> wow, what a great. Uh, see, and this type of avoiding is what not Last is going to need to do in game two and three if he wants to take this set. <gasps> oh, oh, no. oh, 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 no. yo, man. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> That's where it hurts, man, because there's nothing you can do on this entire planet. <laughs> put, put the Jaws theme on in the background, <laughs> just waiting for it. He just wanted the opportunity, like, man, when when, when are you going to commit? Yeah. When do you want to commit for shield? If you don't want to commit, if you don't want to, like, if you hold shield to take shield damage. Yeah. Hmm? I don't have my card on me. Yeah, I was like, so you have to, like, hold shield? Mm. And that gives you enough time to come back on stage or even get a grab. Yeah. And if you don't hold shield, you're going to take the damage. So yeah. you're, da <laughs> you're damned if you do, damned if you don't. And it's even worse than Mega Man's uh, uh, side B because, you know, that blows up after a certain amount of time. Mm -hmm. That C4 it stays there. Like, uh, do you know uh, about the uh, uh, team combo with Snake and Meta Knight? I've, I've heard, oh, you put it on Meta Knight and then he goes for the up throw and then he blows you up. Yeah, yeah. And then, you, yeah, you get, the, you get the kill from there. <laughs> you know, those types of scenarios. Yo, yeah. but you smelling good, bro. Are you wearing cologne? Yeah, let's go. Tournament Sorry, hygiene. No, no, no. Yeah. <laughs> Tournament hygiene. Put on your deodorant. Hmm? What'd you use? It's good, bro. That's right. Antiperspirant. I need, I need better. I don't know. Whatever Old Spice you're wearing, I need that one. I we, use Bear Glow. We here at Hollywood Action Tuesdays support Old Spice and support uh, deodorant in general. We also support this wonderful second game that's going on. You know, in that first game, Peach started, you know, with a 50-60% lead, but, you know, Snake just commanded yeah. it the entire time. Sorry, guys. I like Nico, like, right next to me. I was like, yo, bro, you actually smell good. Man takes care of himself. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. That's what I was telling I was telling the guy earlier, like, I was like, bro, this is an FGC tournament, not a Fortnite, not like, <laughs> not like a Ninja's Ninja's best Twitch uh, <laughs> highlights. Compilations, yeah. 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 All right. Anyways, let's get back to the game. I apologize. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I apologize for going off Andrew here, but no, it's absolutely okay. It gives the it gives the audience an immersive experience into yeah. what we have here at Hollywood Action Tuesday. Exactly. Anybody watching a Snake versus Peach <laughs> matchup for knowledge is gonna know. Like, man, Eco smells good. For some reason, <laughs> we have Fortnite tutorial music in the background. <laughs> and Miss Peach has pulled ahead despite all odds. <laughs> <laughs> All right, toss the grenade at that point. Like, oh. you want. I respect we toss the grenade, but I would have liked to have seen him set up the grenade and wait for not last to make the recovery from the ledge. Mm -hmm. um, that way, he has that, like, set up perfectly. But speaking of setting up perfectly, he has a grenade there. He has a grenade behind him. Goes for the pickup. Has the anti air with the outside. Oh I saw God, at look that at this wall. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He built a wall, and even though he had none of the ledge covered. He makes sure that when Not Last comes back on the stage, he has so much to worry about. The second I said it, I knew someone. I, I knew it was going to go there. But let's see. I, you know, I think a big thing for uh, Peach in this is going to be able to take his recovery and really nullify it. So, uh, Peach can stay out uh, off stage so long that it's going to be really important to get him off of his upbeat. Oh man, at that point, that was a juke. Like, let me set this, let me set the C4 real quick. Go for the go for the tiger lunge and immediately just get you off guard. Ooh. Dash attack putting him off stage. Oh, oh, I no. oh you're love good. That. that dang. Nair actually surpassing the eight it's actually eight point eight percent threshold that you have to get on Snake um Cypher to be able to just take it down. Yeah. It is eight percent, but it's eight point eight if you don't have anything. And what I like about the soft in there was uh the whole reason Key air dodged was that he was expecting a fair or a bear and he was going to tech the stage but wasn't able to because of the soft hit. Yeah. This is big damage that not last to put on Key. Oh, Ooh, man, he just went for the axe kick. You knew he wanted it. C4 on the left side of the stage, so we'll see if that comes into play quickly. Oh, uh, yeah. Just a bit too late. Okay, goes for the high recovery. I like it because oh. Nalas has been so good at covering the horizontal area, so he knows. Like, I have to go high. Uh -oh. I felt that Nalas probably should have set up turn up or a little bit more. Able to pull it in, go for a dash attack. Nice. He's so good with that. because Quick easy combo, yeah. Yeah, easy combo, easy percent, and it's, like, really good. <gasps> he got it, he got it, he got it. But, oh. unfortunately, did not surpass the threshold. This is not smash for it, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The no, reverse what, hit of... T uh, yeah. yeah, talk to me. What, what, we didn't, what didn't get him, though, is the fact that he had... In the key, um, Cypher armor. That's what ended up oh, happening. Oh, thank you. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I couldn't even see that high. You need to make sure that it's 8.8% to actually beat it. And there's the trick play. 2-0 for Key. Proving his PR spot yet again. Great job to both players. Yeah. But, I mean, it's nothing to say that Not Last wasn't far behind.